Hello, Artifact. This is Artifacts of Mars, and you're not going to believe this one. An adjunct professor at Southern State Community College in Ohio is under investigation for threatening to shoot up the NRA. James Pierce wrote in a Facebook post on June 13th calling on other anti-gun types to storm the NRA headquarters and make sure there are no survivors. SSCC is allowing law enforcement to investigate the case. You mean law enforcement needs their permission? And suggested a negative finding could be grounds for termination. He should be gone right now, and he should be in a prison cell. And right here's a copy of the post on campus reform. Look, there's only one solution. A bunch of us anti-gun types are going to have to arm ourselves, storm the NRA headquarters in Fairfax, Virginia, and make sure there are no survivors. What a barbarian! Oh my god. This action might also require coordinated hits at remote sites like Washington lobbyists. Then and only then will we see some legislative action on assault weapons. Have a nice day. Uh, he should be in a prison cell right now. Uh, this isn't even being reported by the mainstream news, which is no surprise. The Highland County Press Report and Pierce's comments were sent to authorities in SSCC on June 15th. Chris, let's take a look at that. Hang on. All right, here it is. Uh, same basic information said, uh, you know, there should be co coordinated hits. Chief Hillsboro Chief of Police Todd Whited and HPD officer Eric Daniels brought this to our attention early in the week. Police Department received a complaint from a former SSCC student and then informed SSCC. We discussed proper, proper avenue. I took the information to VP. Dr. Nicole Rhodes, who would be his immediate supervisor, Heaton said. Chief Whited took the information Highland County Sheriff Donnie Barrera since the post was made in the county. Dr. Rhodes contacted the Ohio Attorney General. Sheriff sent the information to the FBI and Department of Homeland Security. The Attorney General advised Dr. Rhodes to take no action until feds had completed the investigation. In addition to Boys and SSCC Board of Trustees, Highland County Press has asked Chief White Whited, Sheriff Barrera, and the Ohio Attorney General Office for comment. This is unbelievable that uh, he is not in a prison cell awaiting trial. And this is on record. He said it on uh, online. There's nothing to argue about as far as did he say it. Yeah, he did. He's calling for the murder, multiple mass murders. And that's the only thing that really matters here. He should be arrested immediately. Of course, we have to do these investigations. Screw that. Arrest them. Put it before a grand jury. Let them decide whether to put them up on charges. That's the way it's usually done. So we're going to go back to campus reform. In general, the college would alert local authorities about any threats that remain. To the, made known to the college, especially any threats made to students, faculty, or staff, she explained. 
We have a good working relationship with the police jurisdictions covering each of our four campuses and trust they would follow the protocols for reporting to other agencies. As I understand it, the report does not necessarily mean an investigation. When asked if Prius will continue to teach during the investigation, Cross said certainly any pr criminal prosecutions and findings could be considerations for employment decisions in any manner of criminal conduct. Translation? She's perfectly fine with it. On June 17, SSCC Security Emergency Response Coordinator Gary Heaton noted the information had been reported to the FBI and Department of Homeland Security. Uh, well, this is a civil case. I can't quote chapter and verse, but you can't uh, go threatening to sh shoot things up. He should be arrested immediately. Here we have it out in the open, and nothing basically is going to be done about it, which means this vile, disgusting animal is going to continue teaching, unless I miss my guess. I could be wrong. He could wind up uh, in the Iron Bar Motel, but... I would say the odds against that are pretty steep, judging from the lack, uh, lackluster, uh, the lackluster response to this uh, is just unbelievable. He, you know, this guy just belongs in prison. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. No matter of facts, Mars. Thanks for watching.